On this video, I'm going to show you how to change the sorting feature for the directory or your staff directory. By default, the staff directory is sorted by alphabetical order of last name followed by first name. But on this video, I'm going to show you how to sort in a different way. So when you're logged into the back end or the dashboard of your website, scroll down to where it reads connections and hover over that and then click on manage. So this will bring up a page that shows all the people listed in your staff directory. And what we want to do is we want to look at the ID number of each of the people in the staff directory and we're going to jot down their ID numbers. Now to find the ID numbers, there's a little bit of a manual process here. And so what you do is just put your cursor and hover over the name of the person that you want to be listed first. And if you look at the bottom of my screen here, and I can't point to it with my cursor because as soon as I take this off, it disappears. But if you look at the bottom, you'll see a web address down at the bottom of the page. And in that web address towards the end, there's something that reads edit underscore entry, the ampersand sign ID equals, and then a number. And that ID equals number is what you want to pay attention to. So for this particular case, Paul has an ID of one. And so if we want to have Paul listed first, I'm going to jot down his ID number. And then if we want to have Kurt listed second, I'll look down at the URL and find out that his ID equals three. So I'll jot that down next. And then if I want to have Mark listed last, I'll look down at the URL and see that his ID number is two. So now that I've written those down in order, what I want to do is I'm going to go to the page where my staff directory appears and I'm going to have to insert a little bit of code onto that page so it knows to sort by a different setting than alphabetical order. So I will start by going to that page. So I want to go to pages and hover over that. Click on all pages. And then scroll down and find the page where my directory is listed. In this case, mine is called directory and click on the title of the page. And you'll see here that there's the code for the connections plugin or our directory. And what we want to do is we're going to replace that code with a different code that also includes how we're going to sort the entries of our staff directory. So I have taken the code that you need to sort and I've put it onto a Word document and it's listed right here. And so you'll probably want to jot this down or type it into a Word document and save it. But I'm going to highlight it and I'm going to copy it by hitting control and then C and then I'm going to go down and switch over to the page that my directory is located and I'm going to delete this and then paste that new code. So at this point this has the code but we now need to customize that code so it knows how to sort. So right here where it shows the parentheses, ID parentheses, we're going to delete all of that there. And then I'm going to simply type in the numbers of the IDs in the order that I want them to display. So Paul's ID was number one, followed by a comma. Kurt's ID was number three, followed by a comma. And then Mark's ID was two. And that is the code that I want to leave on this page so it will sort and put those uh, listings in that order. So at that point, all I need to do is click Update. And this will record those changes. And then if I go out to my staff directory, this is the old page, so I'm going to go ahead and refresh it. And now you will see that they are in the order that I had directed it to be. 
So that is how you sort your entries of your staff directory in a different manner than what is default. I hope this gave you a better understanding of how to manage your staff directory. Please come back and watch more video tutorials on WordPress so we can help you accomplish your mission online.